what is going on YouTube it's your boy Billy Kibaki and in today's video I'll be showing you how to play Nintendo Wii games on your jailbroken PS4 5.05 .05 using Linux OS alright um, I've done video how to install Linux play PSP games PS1 Nintendo 64 um, those links will be in the description if you guys want to check them out alright so let's go ahead and get started keep in mind guys that you should have your your portable hard drive connected to your PS4 with Linux installed on it you should have your USB mouse your USB hub connected to your PS4 alright so let's go and show you guys the games that I'm using so right here I have my USB stick and make sure that you guys format the USB stick to XFAT because XFAT allows large file transfer on your USB stick okay so make sure that you format it to XFAT for large files okay also keep in mind that some of the Wii games are ISOs and some of the Wii games are WBFS format alright so with ISOs um, all you have to do is just copy it on your USB stick with the folder name and with the WBFS just copy it on your USB stick with the name of the game and what we can do from right here is just go ahead create a folder and we're gonna call this folder um, we games that's it now drag your Wii games over in it and I'm gonna show you guys that both format works I'm gonna show you that ISO format work and I'm gonna show you that WBFS format work alright so let's go ahead and eject our USB stick and head over to the PS4 okay guys so now that we're on the PS4 make sure that your your PS4 controller is connected by a USB cable make sure that your USB mouse is connected to the USB hub and connected to your PS4 and also make sure that your um, Linux portable hard drive is also connected to your PS4 and you should have internet enabled on your PS4 okay alright so let's go over to internet browser press yes if you get this message yes again and make sure that you guys enter that URL right there make sure that it ends with VRAM 3 okay you guys should know about this from my last videos so make sure that it ends with VRAM 3 so give it time until it loads okay guys so as you can see Linux loads up on our PS4 and I have my USB mouse connected to the USB hub so let's go up to this icon right here if your menu is like this what you have to do is go to JWM config and go down to refresh um, in my last video um, I always turn these off but just do a just do a refresh menu just give it time once you do the refresh menu there you go we now have a full menu right here alright so let's go over to file manager let's go down to the um, USB that we have connected to the PS4 so this is mine and right here you can see that I have the Wii games folder so I'm just gonna click it right click copy I'm gonna go to home folder go to ROMs and I'm gonna paste my folder right there with the Wii games okay guys so now that our Wii games folder copied over to the PS4 also guys make sure that you keep your eyes on your total space that you have remaining on your PS4 okay so once you finish copying over your um, Wii games um, we can close this down go back over to the icon go down to games go to dolphin emulator 
Okay guys, so as you can see, the emulator just popped up. So what you want to do first is go to controller and you want to come down here and you want to click on configure. Then from right here, you want to select your PS4 controller. Make sure that it's connected with the USB cable. Then you can go ahead and start to remap your PS4 controller. Okay, so I'm just going to click right here for A and that's it go ahead and press close close this down now click on open go to ROMs go to your Wii games folder and I'm gonna do Pokemon first just to show you guys that ISOs work so I'm just gonna click it and click open And there you go guys um, some of the games will be a little bit laggy um, some some might run really perfect but it does work all right and there you go Pokemon for the Wii loads up perfectly fine on our jailbroken PS4 all right so I'm just gonna go ahead and close the emulator down then I'm going to click open again, go back to ROMs, Wii games, and I'm going to show you that the WBFS format works as well. So I'm just going to click open. There you go. There it is, guys. We now have Zelda running on our jailbroken PS4. The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. So it's as easy as that guys just follow the steps and you can have it done as well guys if the video was helpful please leave a like a share the video around and also you can subscribe for more video to come thank you all for watching and i will see you guys in my next video